call it moving day at the nation's capital. These workers splash on fresh paint and the furniture awaits its place as the GOP sees its November dream come true. As for Congressman Tom Wiley, he's not moving in, he's moving up. Every time somebody says to me, Mr. Chairman, I keep wanting to look over my shoulder to see where John Dingell is. When the curtain lifts tomorrow on the 104th Congress, Bliley moves center stage and takes over the House Commerce Committee, a committee that sees 40% of all legislation. Speaker-to-be Newt Gingrich handpicked Bliley. The 62-year-old Virginian is known to get along well with Democrats. We simply did not have the votes to move anything of importance by ourselves. So we had to work with the other side of the aisle. Critics say Bliley's political stands can at times be uncompromising. As you enter his office, you immediately see his support for the tobacco industry hanging on the wall. Congressman Rick Boucher is the only other Virginia lawmaker on the Commerce Committee, and he's a Democrat. And I think as chairman of the committee, we can expect that Tom will be very bipartisan, just as he has been in this past years in Congress. Congressman Bliley says one of President Clinton's mistakes was promising too much to the American people. Some say the Republicans have been doing just that since the November elections. And even Bliley admits turning GOP rhetoric into true government reform will be the supreme challenge. In Washington, Scott Light, WTBR News Channel 6.